day guys well it's been about two weeks or so since I sold my Z06 and about a week since I put the order in for my new C8 Corvette and already I'm going through withdrawals kind of like an addiction I have uh, with nothing in my garage so today I'm taking a look at a car that I've got here at the shop to check it over to see if I'm going to purchase it or not and it is a <laughs> Two thousand and five, just a base model Corvette. Again, just a reminder: this isn't my car that I'm going to keep for a long time or anything. This is just a vehicle that I need to tie me over to get my fix, uh, sort of thing. But it's a very nice looking car that I found uh, on Kijiji, I believe, and uh, it's local car here, and uh, it, it just has a lot of cool accessories on it. It's like again, it's not a Z06, it's not a, it's the grandpa version. However, it's dressed up really nice. I think uh, it's got a lot of the ZR1 features like the splitter on the bottom here uh, the side skirts and the wheels look like replica perhaps of uh, another make anyway for the ZR1 it's got those brake caliper covers which I'm not too fond of however gives it a nice look anyway uh, carbon fire a lot of carbon fiber wrap um, all over the vehicle here the doors nice little touches uh, all around these uh, side marker lights this looks like a ZR1 spoiler that's been wrapped in it as well. The back tail lights are blacked out and they are LED as well. Uh, looks like you did the emblems as well in that wrap. Uh, it's got a Corsa exhaust. I'm told it's got a Corsa cross or X pipe and mufflers on it. Um, it's 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 lowered. They've lowered the car and it's really low to a point where I if I were to purchase this I may bring it up an inch or so just because I can't get in and out of driveways without putting some kind of board or so uh, underneath the, the wheels to get up onto my driveway. So I think I've got to raise it up a bit if I were to purchase it which I mean it's looking like I may. Uh, I'm getting some blacked out headlights those are really expensive by the way um, again he wrapped the, the emblem here and really clean car looks really clean he's kept good care of it it's got the uh, clear top here uh, it's not a it's not a uh, painted top Let's see if I can get into this thing there we go interior again is very clean I, I could tell this guy's you know pretty OCD about his cars and he he's got all these changed to you know maybe a carbon fiber uh, plastic of some sort all the silver in these cars that makes them look cheap have been replaced it's got the selective ride control uh, it's a six-speed car seats are in decent shape especially here where everybody gets in and out typical problem not sure where he got these on or where he got those to put on there but uh, looks really, really clean. It's got the heads-up display. Doesn't have the heated seats, which I'm not too concerned about. It's got an aftermarket stereo system. Uh, Pioneer, but really nice system. It's got navigation, uh, Bluetooth, the whole thing. And he's also got a backup camera on this as well, which is pretty cool. Um, let's take a look at the trunk here. And he's got a bit of a bumping system in this thing, which... I don't really care too much about but it's there not sure if that's a good system or not it sounds great really clean though really really clean car tell me what you guys think um, I'm considering this thing at least that it, it'll keep me occupied for the next seven or eight months till my C8 comes in uh, seems like a decent car drove it for a little bit drives really good perhaps we'll go on a test drive with it and uh, see how it runs okay let's take this for a ride Hopefully my skirt here, you'll see what I'm talking about. Uh, you can hear the scraping on the ground. I got I would have to lift it for sure. I know it looks cool and everything. Some of you guys might like it, but uh, it's just way too low. It's pretty good keep in mind like I said guys this isn't a Z06 or it's just a base model and again it's something that I, I I'm thinking about getting just to uh, have a little fun on weekends and stuff uh, with the car uh, because I have nothing else uh, to have a little fun with so until the new car comes in this might tie me over and uh, 
you know, they, they're 400 horsepower factory. Um, this has uh, a sport exhaust and the, the Corsa sport exhaust and the uh, Hurricane intake on it. And uh, I may give it a tune. I have a tuner. I may uh, tune it a bit and see if we can get a little extra out of it. But they, they come factory 400 horse. I think zero to 60 times are 4.5 seconds, which is not crazy fast, but it's also not slow. Um, and uh, it does quarter mile in like 12.7 from the factory. So not too, too bad. Yeah, they look great. The car really looks good. It, like I said, he's done a lot of accessory work to it and, and, and it looks really sharp. Um, and you know, if I can get my money back uh, maybe next spring or so, then uh, it's done its job for me. Okay, we'll turn on this street. It's a bit of an open road here with uh, not too many houses or anything. Let's see if we can give her a little. I'm not going to go crazy, but let's see. That's about it. Yeah, really quick. Pretty quick, what you'd expect from a Corvette. I mean, it's not going to break any records, but it's uh, got a lot of power. I really enjoy these cars. I really like these cars. Drives really nice. job inside getting rid of that plasticky gray look that most of these cars have he's done all the trim in this carbon fiber look-alike plastic perhaps not sure I don't think it's real but uh, it's pretty it's pretty nice looking the exhaust got a nice pop to it when I downshift it's popping out the back sport mode on the suspension it uh, surely made a difference going back to touring a lot softer ride and these roads are rough too maybe on smoother roads it wouldn't be so bad well here we go again let's see if we can scrape that splitter off ah. oh didn't scrape But let me know what you think and if there's anything you would change and like I said I would lift this up probably an inch or so just to clear and it looks like he's done the back as well so I may have to bring up the back a little bit as well but uh, let me know what you guys think if there's anything you would change if I were to purchase this I mean it looks pretty good I, again I don't like those caliper covers but the, the intent of this car is not to keep it for me uh, for that long it's just to keep me uh, occupied with a car for the next seven or eight months or so uh, so I may leave it on there just so that next person buy it it can be their decision if they're going to uh, take them off or not but looks really good tell me what you think leave me some comments I'd appreciate that I, I, I'm not sure what to do with this other than raising it a bit uh, should I remove those caliper covers should I uh, bring it back to stock a little bit or leave it as it is let me know what you think give me a thumbs up please subscribe we'll see you on the next one Peace.